up you guys boy perverse senpai here and today we're gonna be reacting to komi can't communicate episode 9 and i want to say that we finally reached to 120 subscribers in this channel of mine now i used to have a lot more on tiktok but things happened so i had to remake a new tiktok channel but the links are in the descriptions for my other channels that i use but if you guys do enjoy today's episode reaction please drop a like you know it would help me push this content of mine further to other new viewers that may like this type of content as well and i also highly recommend to subscribe on this channel because i'm going to be dropping an anime rewind 2021 video but anyways that is all i have to talk about let's hop on to the episode whoa who's this suppressive person oh damn did we get a new character yo okay short hair short hair i i like it i dig it oh She's a peasant. Man, dude, everybody's a peasant one way or another, right? Dude, honestly, this music slaps, dude. <laughs> I don't know how many times I have to say it. Oh, okay, so this girl is like a peasant, so she's more of a country girl. Ooh, hey, yo, that's pretty short. Oh, no, wait, never mind. It's longer than the normal skirt size. <laughs> of course, the new character admires Comey no matter what. Yo, wait, who does she think she is, like, demanding our MC guy going around? <laughs> exactly, go get it yourself. What? No way, Komi's actually gonna get the Subway sandwich? Uh, I'm actually interested how Komi's gonna order this time. Okay, wait, now I, I always forget that. In anime, they always gotta, like, make, like, if it's, like, a fast food, like, McDonald's, they always gotta write it differently. My bad before if I was trying to correct it, but this is the only way that people can only get away with things of, I guess, animation without getting uh, sued or something like that by using a company's name. But let's continue seeing how Komi is gonna fuck this up. Oh my god, they're two stalkers. Dude, the MC got Comey's back, like, straight up. <laughs> oh, dude, uh, it's always nerve-wracking because, like, in Subway, you always gotta get your orders fast. Like, you gotta choose your topping really fast because if there's, like, a big line behind of you, you can feel the tense of the pressure that the people are just like come on man come on man just just get your sandwich done come on man i mean for me i don't give a fuck but there's times where i'm like oh fuck what did i want what i forgot what i was gonna say <laughs> oh she's retreating of course well of course anything that komi does just makes her shine brighter oh oh no why so many questions good oh wow holy crap that's a lot of questions actually Oh, don't make Komi, don't make Komi cry. Yes, bow down. Oh, video games. Mm, let's see how this goes. Games of God is with too much money. You have some time on thine hands. Why is she sounding like one of those 1800s people that writes their stories like uh, the person that made Romeo and Juliet, you know? These shall be playing video games for life. Oh, it's, the, it's that person. Hey, yo, I like her setup though. <laughs> oh dude i'm sorry i just it's just i find it funny um yo that's a lot of straps my guy are, are you sure you're not hiding anything under the skirt yeah man they just went into a fantasy world my guy yo okay yo that screen i like that Ayo, Comey approves. Comey approves. Yo, she got that chair. All right, wait, wait, wait. Hold up, hold up. How far does that chair bend, huh? Can it do this? Uh, I mean, I promise it goes farther, but right now my room is small, so can't do that right now. Damn, man. The passion. The passion in this girl of games makes me want to cry. Mm, such a shame Komi does not understand our language of gamers. Quick, you must impress her with something even more gracious. Oh wow, she invited the whole other crew. Damn, okay, Komi's friend group is kind of actually getting bigger and bigger. And I'm surprising that it's like growing this fast within this many episodes. Y'all, are they gonna play Mario Party? <laughs> ah, okay, they're playing the ripoff of Smash Bros. Okay. Damn, man, she's taking advantage of the new player. How can you? Hey, yo, defending the person, dude. Let's go. Hey, you're a guest in this house. You can't automatically fight the other guests. Man, I find this very adorable. Why, why, Komi? Why did you suicide? What the hell? 
Damn, okay, dude, these fight animations, not bad, not bad. Oh shit, dude, I was not expecting like character development in this game. <laughs> dude, Tanado is trying to help her and she actually like attacked him. Oh wow, Komi did something unintentional that helped the other character defeat the other person. Ah oh, man, this is some wholesome shit right here. Playing with a group of friends. Well, I want to say friendly game, but in a good game, that's that's pretty good. Oh damn, wait, Komi has a part-time job now? What the heck? Oh no, this is the worst thing to do for Komi. Oh, and she left Komi out there? Bastard. Of course, she's going to be a natural in this job because she talks to anybody. But Komi sees determination. All right, let's see how she does. I'm pretty sure everyone's going to get her sub because how beautiful she is, right? Oh, now she's about to cry. Please, Coco Cola Bear, help her, please. Oh, man, she's in a bad situation. But good thing Komi is around with tissues, right? Oh, come on, bro. Being Komi shoes, man, she's trying to dis distribute some tissues to strangers that she has a hard time talking to. Come on, man. <laughs> oh my fucking god, dude. Dude, Komi is scared to her death life. Oh, wow. So it only took one person to start, you know, giving out to things. And with that, they finished. Ah, bad. Good job, Komi. And uh, Tunes of Day that helped her out at the end. That was a nice adventure that Komi had. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is Tano the, the bear? Nah, nah. Unless. I fuck. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, but he's dying inside. Ah, yes. We're back in the classroom. What a good adventure. Now they're back into school. Wait, what's down on Tano? What's on his face? What the heck? Birdseed? Dude, this guy is a bird. You should tell him. You should definitely tell him that there's something on his face. Dude, I'm telling you, it's Birdseed. He's secretly a bird. He, he just never wanted to tell you, Komi. Wait, whoa, whoa. What the hell is happening? Why is everyone having Birdseed on their face? What the fuck? Now I'm, I'm confused with Komi. What the hell is happening? Yeah, this has to be a nightmare, right? Ah, thank God it was a bad dream. Jesus Christ. Oh wait, hold up a fucking minute. This guy has birdseed on his mouth again. Is Komi a sidekick? Was she able to tell us something in the future? Is Komi jealous? <laughs> I think Komi's jealous. I think she wants to have like a normal... Wait, call me by my name too? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, call her by the first name, bro. Yo, that's a whole new level. I mean, Tano, though, that's the next step of, uh, you know, getting closer to her, right? Sure. Ah, uh, fucking. You failed! Wait, wait, hold up. I was not expecting this Uno reverse card. Wait, Komi has to say his name? Oh, uh, damn. Dude, wait. Okay, I'll be even more impressed if Komi actually says his name. Oh, <laughs> you can't write it. You gotta say it. Ah, oh, man. I was really hoping she was gonna say it. All right, time to review today's episode. So we got to meet a new character and it's the country girl. I totally forgot her name. I really did. But this country girl, obviously she's not went to like certain areas like Subway, for example. She's never been to these uh, inside uh, fast food areas where there's people that are dressed up nicely or that talk professionally or have a good accent as some could say or that city accent i don't know if it's just me but that country girl her she sounded a bit different in a way maybe they actually added some accent to this uh voice which i would say it's really good if they did because as always komi is always in the center of everything and this country girl was observing komi as what komi would do when she entered the subway and of course she dipped the first time second time she was able to make her an order quietly and of course komi always fucks up the order of uh Na najimi but najimi she tries to say sorry to komi after she says some bad words to komi and then on to the next one of the subject is the video games and let me tell you that the goth girl i'm just gonna say goth girl i forgot her like real name her gaming setup is oof 
it's it's good i like her gaming setup and especially the, the screen but not also that she was actually able to invite komi to her room which has been a long time since she invited any of her friends since elementary and she ended up also inviting the other two because she didn't really know what to do with komi so she ended up inviting najimi and tadaro and they ended up playing a ripoff version of Smash Bros. And that led to some very wholesome things of Tanodo teaching Komi how to play the game to when the goth girl was protecting Komi from Najimi that was trying to be sweaty as a gamer that she is in the inside. She just doesn't want to admit it and out there in the public yet. And I don't know about you guys, but at that kind of ending where Tanodo and Komi were trying to say each other's first names, I found that kind of adorable, honestly. As I thought Komi was a bit jealous that Tanodo kept on calling Najimi by her first name. But then at the end, Komi and and Tanado were not able to say the first name of each other's because they were just too embarrassed for now. But who knows, maybe they'll actually start doing it in the future. And but we only got like what three more episodes. And my hopes that I hope there's a lot more progression within these three episodes. Because I do enjoy Tanado and Komi's moments by themselves together. As though Komi is the main protagonist in this show, that we get to see her, her little adventures on the things that she never was able to experience without Tanado's help. But anyways, if you guys did enjoy my reaction on today's video, why not hit that like button? It does help me a lot by pushing this content of mine up to other viewers that may like the same thing that you're watching. And comment down in the comment section of who's your second favorite character in this anime because I know all your favorite characters in this anime or oh, the first one is gonna be Komi so type in who is your second favorite in this anime in the comment section and if you've been watching a lot of my stuff recently why not hit the subscribe button you know if you haven't subscribed yet but anyways this has been your boy perverted senpai and I'll see you guys on the next episode